all this jealousy that stems from social media and that that's one of the worst things yeah. that will just kill it your relationship. I do agree. Off. I do agree. Yeah, I agree. Do you like pull in front of each other? Because <laughs> I feel like <laughs> that's the same. All girls have gone through heartbreaks. Like, have you ever went through heartbreak where you've been ill? Oh yeah, I would literally yeah. lost two stone <gasps> in like a month. Um, didn't eat for three months. Then it put me on antidepressants. Like, I was awful. I just, it was like my first one, and I was fully enthralled by this horrible, emotionally abusive, dirty piece of work. Did and it affected it, anything yeah, else? Yeah, it set around. me up to fail They're for every other relationship. Mental I abusive had. Yeah. yeah, and I didn't even know it was like mentally. It was mentally abusing in the way that I would not even realise at all. When my friends were from the outside were saying, Livia, like, you have changed, like, where are mm. you? And mm. I could not even tell. And well, then it affected this last for? two years, and then oh I got gosh. back with him after <gasps> cheating on me again. You got back after all that? Really? I was just a broken person, and I had no self-respect, and then Love Island literally saved, saved me completely. It's because going to say I no, started, not for you. Yeah, yeah. And <laughs> it, but in the beginning it was hard, because you sort of heartbreak, then it made me think that everyone else was like that, and mm. I just hope that no other girl thinks like that, because mm. there is people out there that are decent, but it genuinely makes you scared to trust anyone ever again. Yeah. I remember the first, well, yeah, the first ever heartbreak I had, I was, it was when I came out the valleys, I was with this guy for five years, like, we were, like, best friends, like, he lived mm. with my parents, lived with us, and we were really close, and I come out, and I remember we lived together, and he just said, Oh, I just I don't want to be with you anymore. And I remember it was and I remember we lived together and had the keys to my house and I went into my house one day to get some of my stuff and he was sat on the sofa eating a dominoes having a two for Tuesday with this girl and I remember what? just oh breaking my God. Yeah, I was literally like oh, sitting on my sofa that I bought as well. That was just probably like the worst feeling ever. I did like like you didn't eat, no. like couldn't sleep, like he was it's, it's weird because you're so used to being with someone and then they're just completely cut out of your life and the way he done it was just yeah. like Awful. I and I think it's, it's no. probably that as well. Like when when they finish you or they do something, it makes you want them more. Oh, it makes, yeah. You know, you know, it's so wrong yeah. to go back. You're stalking That's their profile. Yeah, it's like you want you because they've done something with another girl. You're like, want me? Yeah, and yeah. Want a lot me of instead. girls do that, and that's not a good way to go. I think yeah. once a boy breaks your heart and does it, you leave him. Be so strong. Yeah. yeah, and leave it. Yeah. What do you think makes like a happy relationship? I don't know, when I look at you, like I think a lot of people as well, like you see you and Alex on social media and people look at you and they're like, oh my God, we want to be happy mm, like that. Yeah. But about the same time, there's probably closed doors and you probably have a row over the bloody, the, the yeah. dinner getting over Like we stuff. bicker about the silliest things, but we don't stay mad at each other. And I won't lie, I think I'm one of the luckiest people to end up with someone like him because I do think we've got a relationship, but oh. in this day and age, is so Hard. rare because so many people believe the grass is greener. Yeah, and that's 100%. the issue. Like we've got all Instagram, Facebook, we've got so many ways oh, of people connecting you mm. and you can get in touch with a girl just by messaging and then that's all ruined, and yeah. you ruined it. That's what frustrates me about the relationships mm. nowadays. I think to have a happy relationship you need to learn that not every opportunity is worth taking and you mm. do have you do have enough at home and you do mm. have something that's more worthwhile than going and sleeping with yeah, Nicola yeah, down the yeah, road, for you know one what I mean? night, for exactly, one night. And yeah. I think me and Alex both realise that and the way our relationship is, the reason why our relationship is happy is because we both know we've got something good. Yeah, because you're like, so happy, people want yeah, it. Yeah, people don't like to feel, don't You don't they? see happy relationships on TV, you see, for, for example, on The Only Way is Essex, you see relationships Fair. crash, you see all of yeah. that because people want don't want to see something that's working because mm. it's not interesting. But that's where it works and we're, we're not bothered about that. But again, you can have a good relationship, but it has to be based on trust. Do you like pulling in front of each other? Because I feel like <laughs> that's the same. You listen, right? someone no. said this the other day, and they were like, if you poo in front of each other in a relationship, yeah. it means like. Oh, it means. I, like, but that, I yeah. said, I'm a prude. Like, I don't like. I don't like. Would farting. you not poo in front of each I wouldn't even fart in front of each I mom. literally <laughs> pop a fart out 20 times, <laughs> like, constantly. Do you fart in front of each other? I honestly. I mean, on you. you no, six years. Never did what? I have a pair in front of Joel. No he never, way. He never you you're lying. lying. Can you you're believe lying. it? In six years. Jordan you, Shaw girl, never, never farted, never had a shit in front of my boyfriend. I can't believe that. Alex I, I always wanted that. I envied no, other people. No, even now, I'd be really? like, no, you cannot fart in front of... No, really? I, just, I think it's me, though. I'll have a poo and I'll chat to him. Like, well, I'll have a wee, I'll do a wee. But wait a second, a what happened when you gave birth? Was anyone there? Oh, yeah. What, what do you mean? When you gave birth, was a boy there looking? Well, yeah, he was there, like. Look. And my mum was. Yeah, of course. You've seen my vagina before, guys. So do you think because they've seen that? Do you think because they've seen everything? No, I but before that, that, I was farting in front of him and pooing in front of him. Mm. I feel like that's a, I just a point like in a relationship it. where, like, 
I don't know if you fart and boom, I feel like it brings you closer. What's it like being a single a single man then, Letitia? <laughs> like, is it harder? Like, well, when like, I was a single yeah, man. Yeah, when you were a single man, like relationship well, yeah, wise. Oh yeah, when I was single, um, it was hard. Like, obviously I'd speak to guys, but then you'd have to think, like, yeah. am I go- uh, bring them home? Yeah, would I bring them home to inter? Could they? Yeah, could, how did you, you do that? What? It was it was hard, and yeah, I didn't like it because you you constantly like when you speak to guys, like you you think twice about meeting up with them because you're thinking like, you think oh, about what, your baby first. yeah. When my mum had boyfriends and stuff, they weren't nice people, and I would never want anyone like that around winter. Yeah, I always think if I meet a boy, like. I, I don't want them to have a kid. Really? Oh, I but it's not shallow. It's because not shallow. I think, I think in my head, like, I don't want them to have a child because but you know if, what? if I have a child, I want it to just be our bond. Mm. Yeah. It, but I know it's, it's so nice for other people to probably take on other people's children and yeah. stuff. But for me personally, I just think it's... It, it depends on the person. I don't think you're wrong saying I think, that. I, I think, think I'd rather like someone not just not have a child. If they had a child, I think I'd just one day. them. Really so fast mad because I used to think like that before I had a child and then I had a child yeah. and... I'd rather meet someone that has a child. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Because they, we would be on the same level. Mm. Um, but I get why you think like that. that that's yeah. what I used to be. Mm. be I think, think until like. I have a probably child of my own, I'd never understand. Yeah, it. exactly. Yeah. Do you find that you think in a completely different way? Oh, a completely different way from yeah. Before I had winter, definitely everything changes. Changes it's like your a life, mindset. doesn't it? Yeah. I know where I'm going wrong. I need a shit in front of a lad and I need a kid. 